hey guys welcome back to our channel if it's your first time here that's my husband linje and my mother-in-law and your beautiful girl gladys lane <laughs> king of the eaters we are in one of the mall that is not far from our home and it has a lot of eating places guys just know one of the places that chinese treasure most other restaurants and here we are in one of my favorite restaurants and large barefoot guys yeah after i recovered from the ankle surgery for all the time mom was taking care of me i wanted to treat her uh, with a delicious meal you saw our videos on mother's day where i wanted to take her out but she refused she really doesn't want to see me spending but in case it's the sun taking us out she's very okay so i told my husband let's go eat out uh it's the it's mommy's first time in this restaurant so i knew she would like that place so that's why we came right there, here guys. that is so so nice it's hot and nice the day I wanted to bring mom here and she refused. She doesn't like going out, eating out and taking her out. She's like, I'm spending. So I told my husband we come and eat from here, the three of us. This is what we have here. Inside here we have mushroom. We are going to be having a mushroom soup. Mm. This is chicken. Jiro. Oh, you have a Oh, this is GP. GP. Yeah, this is chicken. We have beef. This is also beef. This is liver and Chinese cabbage. <laughs> so, this is how you do it. So, what you got? Mm. It's like a barbecue. Shall do the meat first. I've never eaten dripping. Honey wanted some miche and it's not here, so he got it from out. These are the Maybe no toppings, help. all the it's sauce. Huh. Honey, I don't. What be our naga? They really don't taste good at all. I don't like them. Honey, but I that's too know. much on your plate. Mm. Oh. Every time we go eat out, honey helps out. That's all. Okay. And this, honey, I like this. Coriander. How should she? This is one of the Chinese food culture, ordering different kind of meals, vegetables, and we can define this as hot pot soup, where you sit together around the table and you boil things as you're eating them. It's so common in China. So some of you, I know you're going to ask me, you people, did you finish all that meal? <laughs> Guys, just know you can spend like five hours eating, chatting, you know what it happens. 
and uh, in case some food remains and you want to pack it it's okay you can tell people to pack it for you though like for the vegetables if they remain you know you can skip that but just telling you to know in case you want to pack the food whether the raw meat or the cooked meat it's very okay to tell them you know what pack for me this food i want to go with a You want? That's an eight three. Okay. Yeah. Two. 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 I'm so glad my mother-in-law loved the food here and she was so happy, me too. I enjoyed it, it being like my favorite restaurant. The food was so yummy, it was so amazing. So guys, thank you for watching until the end. Just know, that's one of the Chinese culture. That's how they do it. When it comes to food, hey, these people don't joke with food. I told you their love language is food. <laughs> My love, my love language is gifts and care. Just do it. I love you. Give the best care in the world, you know. <laughs> anyway, that was it, guys. But we are still enjoying the food. Feel free to come and join us. And don't forget to subscribe. Just know we love you guys.